Here on Duxbury Beach, backhoes, dump trucks and graders hard at work. Still repairing the damage caused by the violent storms we had this winter. Will you guys be ready to go um, starting tomorrow? We will. They spent over $600,000 to fix up this beach, and the work they've done is extensive. We're talking over five miles of snow fencing, over 10,000 plants were replanted. Another area hit very hard, Long Beach and Plymouth just down the coast. Here, people we talk to say you'll notice a big difference right away. I think it's um, a lot rockier, a lot rockier, less, less of access to sand. There's less sand because of the, the tides change, because of the, the, uh, the storm. How bad was it after these storms this winter? It was an absolute mess. But after spending hundreds of thousands of dollars to clean up the beach after the storms and millions to repair parts of the seawall, the beach is looking good for the holiday weekend. I'm going to say we're over 100 percent. We're really just proud of the public works crews. The fact that they were able to get in here, work so hard, bring in all this equipment and material and get it done in such a short order is something to be proud of. And here on the North Shore at Good Harbor Beach in Gloucester, the damage heavy as well. The dunes hit especially hard. City officials telling the Boston Globe the damage cost as high as $14 million. And as you see the backhoe behind me, uh, moving some of the sand and just look how deep this is. If you're coming out here tomorrow, you're going to see some thick, deep sand.